these weird ass grapes? Why are they so long? It's break time at work. And um, got my hot chocolate coffee. Mm. Let me specify. So I put hot chocolate mix in with my black coffee and it creates an entirely new concoction. And I love it. I call it the Hollywood Mocha. And it's pretty cold out here. Not overly so, but ugh, you can kind of see my purple hair a little bit more. Um, it's nice to have a switch up. Ugh, it's Thursday. Is it payday tomorrow? No. I'm trying to get some semblance of a, of a vlog going. Granted, looking at my car's wheel is not the greatest angle, but hey, that's hands-free. I'm fogging my glasses up. That's really bad. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you know what time it is. It's time to go. It's time to go. Where did my fucking juice go? Where did my juice go? Oh. There it is. I can't remember if I ever showed off my corded zitter before. Probably not because it hasn't been tuned, but I finally was able to find a tool that was the right shape for these pegs. So it's starting to sound more like an actu actual instrument. As opposed to like... Oh, it sounded a lot worse, but it gets out of tune really quickly. So the uh, strings seem really new, so I'm thinking they're just... They just need time to stretch out properly, so I'm gonna have to retune it a whole bunch. Kind of a pain, but hey, I wanna learn how to play this thing. Kinda have like a canon and D thing going on with that. I'm entertaining myself with Drag Cave because I have not been on here in like four years. They've added new dragons and shit. Let me see if I can scroll. That's the last one that I grew up. He grew up December 31st, 2017. Man, it's been a minute. I love like pet simulator games. I always have. And this just harks back to a much different time on the internet because this website has probably not changed since, when is it from? 26, 2016, 2006. So it has its charm, it has its annoyances, but nostalgia is taking over my life again. And speaking of nostalgia, I'm back to listening to old Emily Autumn music. It's too bad Spotify doesn't have Ophelia on here, but I do have the CD, I guess I could dig out. I feel like I always try to do a cleanup vlog, like a room transformation cleanup. Like, here's all the shit and clothes and whatever on my floor, and here's the beautiful afterwards. And I feel like I never get to the beautiful afterwards all at once because right now my floor's pretty clean. I just vacuumed, and my desks are always a, a wreck. A fucking tornado just tore through it. I mean, I'll show you the kind of shit that's on my desk. I'll take my phone out and show you. So here's a bit of what I'm talking about when it comes to the messy desk. Um, it's actually a bit cleaner and less chaotic. I don't want to use the word clean, but relatively it is cleaner than it was. Um, but it's still a pretty unusable space. The problem is I have too many hobbies, too many things that I want to do. Like, here's a bag of feathers that I want to use. My collection of googly eyes. Tacky glue. I mean, 
And this one looks a lot better than it did earlier, too. I just got some new jewelry, so I was trying those on yesterday. And it's it's looked worse, but it has certainly looked better, and it can definitely look better, especially this little corner here, because it's kind of a dumping ground. And I was trying to find my hot glue gun, and all of that in there is craft shit. My new shoes. Oh, I didn't show you my new shoes. It's hard to get them on because look how fucking long those things are. It makes me look a little less stumpy, both because they're platforms and they're thigh high. I think this, um, oh, that had, that had the things I needed to repair in it. And I have my shredder. The shredder is actually a very integral part of my physical and mental cleansing because I can just write shit down that's on my mind and if I feel embarrassed about it, it goes right in the shredder. And I never throw anything away with my address on it, so it works. Oh, you can't see or you're not going to be allowed to see what's right there because they're mini dicks. I love my miniatures. This side doesn't really look too bad. I don't entirely know what to put on this shelf yet. But I like the shelf too much to get rid of it. So I obviously have a bit of a shelf problem. I really just don't give a fuck about dusting. Given that I have so many fucking shelves and desks, I cannot be bothered to dust. And it makes me sneezy. Here's what I was trying to work on. I just got these in the mail the other day. Just these little banner flag things that I'm going to use to put my various pins on. I used to collect these things when I was like in middle school and high school. So I had a massive, massive collection. Most of it I got rid of. And in my adulthood, now that I've started to recollect them, I've, uh, I've really regretted doing that. If you'll direct your attention to the next dusty piece of furniture that I have, I put all of my, well, most of my enamel pins up there and other various pins. I just have so many random shit. So much random shit, not so many random shit. I need to fix my jewelry again. It's fucked up. And I need to make this string light go all the way over here. As far as it'll go at least. Oh hey, how you doing? Here are the finished pin banners. So far so good. I don't think they're gonna stay quite where they are on the wall, but I like it better than where they were before, which was shoved in a box. So minus the dusting part, I got all this jewelry figured out so it's not all laying right on the dresser. And I did end up putting the string lights all the way over here like I wanted to. That little dangly bit's kind of random, but I think it's just gonna have to stay like that. <laughs> this I'm sorry and that's about all I have to say about the matter so I'm getting out of here I don't know what the fuck is gonna end up in my editing program but stay tuned for more shit